here at Tuscaloosa's Coleman Coliseum. Tonight, the Alabama Crimson Tide battled with the Paladins of Furman. Bama takes the victory by a final of 81-73. Welcome back inside Coleman Coliseum. Eli Gold, Coach Wimp Sanderson on the far side, and the Crimson Tide's head coach, Nate Oates, joining us. Congratulations, but you knew going in that Furman was a tough ball club. Yeah, they were really good. I mean, they were ranked in the top 25 last year. Yep. You know, Lyons is back. He had a great year. Mounts is much improved. He's good. I mean, I thought we did a pretty good job on Mounts. We didn't do a very good job on Lyons, but he got off there a little bit late. So, I, you know, I, the one thing I was really pleased with is we didn't let our defensive intensity fall when we were turning the ball over, missing shots. The offense wasn't going bad. I thought we did that last game too sure. much. We, I thought we kept our defensive intensity up for the majority of the game. And late in the game, too, when Furman made a run, uh, you guys stayed right there. You, you know, some teams at home might have gotten flustered, rolled over, played dead, not this bunch. No, they hit some tough shots there. Yeah. Late shoot Lions, and I mean, with the tough foul on Kyra, they, they well, the Lions uh, yeah. made some shots. I think the big thing is that your defense was consistent and you played hard, and I think you're hard to defend. When you spread the floor like that and you run off a, a postman after he gets a basketball, the, the, the screens are a little bit different for you, and the, the court is so spread that uh, your guys got over the screens. I was impressed with it. Then they played hard. They didn't play, they didn't play perfect, and they didn't play the way you wanted them to play in the first half. 14 turnovers is not not pleasing to you or anybody else. But you know you stayed with it, and you, you your other things when you turned it over didn't go south, and that's what was that was what was good about you, you kept kept things even or a little bit better, even though you weren't playing with the basketball as well as you needed to. No, I agree. I mean, we talked about that at Rhode Island. I, they did go south. We yeah. missed threes. I think we missed our first 11 threes. We turned the ball over 14 times sure. in the first half, and I thought our defensive effort, Wayne, we said no matter what happens on offense, we just got to keep playing hard on sure. defense. And, sure. and, you know, if we do that, we can get the win. So I thought we did a decent job. You know, they, they played hard. They that, that's did. a real good team. I mean, they, they beat us on the offensive boards in the second half a little bit. But other than that, I thought our effort. No, I think your, effort's, yeah. your effort's been fine. And you've had a bunch of guys banged up. You're trying to fight different players. And, and, and the other thing, too, the way you're playing, you're probably a little bit stronger coming off the bench. You know, you're showing you're, you're showing one one group, and then you're coming off with guys who've been playing a little bit better from the field coming off the bench, and that's helped you. Yeah, I've always liked to bring a scorer off the bench. I think Shackelford's been really good. Yeah, that. I mean, he comes in and gives you a lift immediately. So he, he was great tonight. I mean, he's he's doing great for a yeah. freshman. Just stays yeah. locked. I thought his defense was significantly improved. Yeah, tonight. it was better tonight. It hadn't it been was. great, but it was better than not. Twenty-eight yeah. to nine, the bench point total. So that was uh, impressive to see. Listen, congratulations. Enjoy your trip to the Bahamas. Neither the coach nor I are allowed to be seen in public in bathing suits, so we won't be joining you. But you have yourself a good time. No, I appreciate it. It's okay. been a good trip for us. Thanks, Paul. All right, Nate Oates Thanks, joining coach. us. Alabama, a winner over Furman, eighty-one seventy-three for the coaches. I'm Eli Gold. Thanks so much for joining us here in Tuscaloosa.